types of organic reactions and mechanisms. Organic reactions can be classified into the following categories. 1. Substitution reactions. 2. Addition reactions. 3. Elimination reactions. 4. Rearrangement reactions. Qualitative analysis of organic compounds. The elements present in organic compounds are carbon and hydrogen. They may also contain oxygen, nitrogen, sulfur, halogens and phosphorus. Detection of carbon and hydrogen. Carbon and hydrogen are detected by heating the compound with copper to oxide. Carbon present in the compound is oxidized to carbon dioxide tested with lime water which develops turbidity and hydrogen to water tested with anhydrous copper sulfate which turns blue. Detection of other elements. Lassine's test is used to detect the presence of nitrogen, sulfur, halogens and phosphorus in an organic compound. The elements present in the compound are converted from covalent form into the ionic form by fusing the compound with sodium metal. Reactions taking place here are cyanide, sulfide and halide of sodium so formed on sodium fusion are extracted from the fused mass by boiling it with distilled water. This extract is known as sodium fusion extract. A. Test for nitrogen. The sodium fusion extract is boiled with iron 2, sulfate, iron sulfate and then acidified with concentrated sulfuric acid. The formation of Prussian blue color confirms the presence of nitrogen. B. Test for sulfur. The sodium fusion extract is acidified with acetic acid and lead acetate is added to it. A black precipitate of lead sulfide indicates the presence of sulfur. If nitrogen and sulfur both are present in an organic compound, sodium thiocyanate is formed. It gives blood red color and no Prussian blue since there are no free cyanide ions. C. Test for halogens. The sodium fusion extract is acidified with nitric acid and then treated with silver nitrate. A white precipitate soluble in ammonium hydroxide shows the presence of chlorine. A yellowish precipitate sparingly soluble in ammonium hydroxide shows the presence of bromine and a yellow precipitate insoluble in ammonium hydroxide shows the presence of iodine. D. Test for phosphorus. The compound is heated with an oxidizing agent, sodium peroxide. Then the phosphorus present in the compound is oxidized to phosphate. The solution is boiled with nitric acid and then treated with ammonium molybdate. A yellow coloration or precipitate indicates the presence of phosphorus.